Hi, today I show you how to create tiles pattern in Illustrator. It will be square mosaic background for bathroom wall or swimming pool floor. At the end I show you some useful bonus trick. Don't forget to like a video and subscribe my channel. Let's begin. Choose a rectangle tool and make a square about 200 pixels on each side. When you're drawing squares, don't forget to hold shift or just click on the screen and write your values. Set no stroke here. Now we have to make some copies of the square. So go to Effect, Distort and Transform and choose Transform. Check Preview and make 4 copies. Move it horizontal to 220 pixels. Click OK. Go to Effect again and choose Transform. This time set Move Vertical to 220 pixels. Horizontal set to 0. Make 4 copies and click OK. We received Simple Squares pattern. Go to Object and choose Expand Appearance. Now each square is separated. I prepared some RGB colors here. You can fill the squares in your favorite colors. Choose Direct Selection tool. Select square and change fill color. You can select more squares at once holding Shift. I'm happy with the result, so now we are going to make a backdrop that will emit a tile fugue. Choose Rectangle tool and make a square, about the size 1100 each side. Choose this fill color. We have to send it to back. So right click your mouse, arrange, send to back. Select all and click horizontal align left and vertical align top. Go to object and click group. Now we can make a pattern. To do that, select our tile and go to Object, Pattern, Make. Zoom out to see more. Don't change anything here and click Done. Our pattern will show up at Swatches panel right here. Now you can draw a random rectangle and choose this pattern. Just expand it and you are done.
Now you have nice bathroom wall texture. I have a bonus for you. I show you how to use this pattern on an equal or curved surface. We need one more thing before we start. Go to Object, Clipping Mask, Release. Now we have full pattern. I'm clean artboards quickly. We have to draw random rectangle. And change it to some unequal shape using direct selection tool. Now I select all and go to object, envelope distort, make with top object. Great, it's pretty nice. Now we can still change our shape. Just choose direct selection tool, click and drag anchor points. When you're happy with the result, go to Object and expand it. You can use this pattern for bottom of the swimming pool. Thanks for watching! If you enjoyed this video, subscribe my channel and give me a like. Check my other videos here. Have a nice day and see you next time.